Welcome to this hands-on review of the LensGo Smoke S Portable Fog Machine. Let's do it. It is absolutely incredible, especially if you're into documentary filmmaking, run and gun filmmaking, or maybe you're operating often as a one-man band. This is a really, really fast, efficient, and effective way to create incredibly cinematic images. You know, creating those light rays, getting haze in your scenes, adding that extra layer of density into the image. If you've watched my channel before, I am huge on using fog and haze in nearly all of your scenes to create more of that Hollywood cinematic style look. If you haven't already, I recommend you check out my videos on the channel here, why and how to use haze and fog. Talking about the system, I just love all of the features it comes with. Again, we've got a lot of options for how we can emit the smoke. And what's really, really powerful about this is you can get a lot of various looks just with this one simple unit. So you can emulate dry ice, so having low lane fog that's great for product videos. You can emit it directly out of the system without any attachment to fill the space as fast as possible. You've got kind of the black scrunchy piece that creates a really, really soft emission, almost like haze in my opinion. And then you've got the various other tube features that allow you to kind of be more directional and create some cool shaping uh, and contour structures with the smoke as well. So you simply flick the power button up, double press to get the fog coming out, single press to turn it off. That's it guys. Simple USB connection in order to plug it in for power, whether you want to run it with power or to charge it and then go portable. Additionally, one of my favorite parts, if not my favorite aspect of this product, it is small, it is compact, it is fast and efficient, and it is portable, guys. The fact that this thing is battery powered, can fit in my hand, I can easily pack it into my backpack with all of the attachments and a ton of extra fluid is just absolutely incredible. Typically, I'm used to bringing out a fog machine. This is a big, bulky device. Initially, I have to find an outlet to plug it in. On top of that, I have to bring a container of additional fluid just in case. And then I also need someone to operate this while I'm filming to make sure the haze comes out. You typically have to press and hold a button. Well, with this device, I can double press and just let the haze come out and slowly but surely fill in the space, right? Super, super effective and efficient there. Not only that, but this brings out the haze instantaneous, guys. I'm already getting fog, right? Now, with a typical fog machine, you can expect it to take anywhere from one minute to five minutes just to warm up so you can start emitting the fog. Now, an additional problem you typically have with fog machines, like the one I have, right, is that after about 30 seconds to a minute of pushing out the fog, it has to stop, heat up again, so it can turn all of that liquid into more smoke that it can emit. Whereas this device, you do not need to stop unless you're literally out of fluid and then you replace it with more fluid. This is an absolute must, guys. If you do a lot of run and gun or any kind of on-the-go filmmaking, if you operate with small, minimal crews, anywhere from a one-man band to a four-man crew size, this is an incredible device to have. And I just absolutely love being able to bring this on each and every single one of my sets now. So whether I'm planning to have a big production or whether I'm planning to use fog or not, I'm gonna bring this. Whereas with my other fog machine, unless I was super intentional about using it, I wasn't bringing it because it just, it was bulky. It was in the way, it was taking up space in my car. And I just didn't wanna deal with the hassle of packing and unpacking something that I didn't even use. This I literally throw in my backpack, so it's with me all the time, no matter what. So I can use it if I want, or I can keep it away if I don't wanna use it. But again, guys, 90% of the time, I am using fog and haze on my productions, and I think this just bumped me up to 99%, because again, it is just making it so, so stupid easy to bring this out and to use it fast, efficient, and effectively. Hope you guys enjoyed this review video. If you did, it would mean a lot if you would subscribe to the channel. Got more fresh and exciting content coming y'all's way. Also, give me a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. If not, I guess thumbs down. I'll take the engagement regardless. <laughs> Outside of that, guys, I hope you have an amazing day. Stay blessed, keep climbing. I'll see y'all at the top, and I'll see y'all in the next. Deuces.